ഓം ശ്രീ ഗുരുഭ്യോ നമഃ ഹരി ഓം സഹനാവതു സഹനൌ ഭുനക്തു സഹവീര്യം കരവാവഹൈ തേജസ്വിനാവധീതമസ്തു മാവിദ്വിഷാവഹൈ ഓം ശാന്തി ശാന്തി ഹരി ഓം so we'll have let's just look at a uh, bird's view of what has been covered so far so in the first valli the teacher and the student is introduced the teacher is yama and the student is nachiketa nachiketa asks for three boons the last boon he wants to know whether anything exists beyond this body if someone dies whether he exists or not exists so the second valli the, then yama says you don't ask this question you ask for something else no no i want to know this only so he club keeps on insisting that and whatever other gifts are offered whatever in spite all the temptations he, has, he tempted this nachiketa very much but he he was not tempted and then he said i don't want any of these things i want to know this only so that was the first chapter the second chapter now we are going through i will read this mantra and then give me anyachreyo annadu deiva preyaha te ubhe nanarte purushakam nanarte purusham sinitaha tayo shreyaha adadanasya sadhu bhavati hiyate artatya upreyo vrinite shreyascha preyasya manushya metaha tau sampadit vivinakti dhiraha ശ്രേയോ ഹി ധീരോ അഭിപ്രേയസോ വൃണീതേ പ്രേയോ മന്ദ യോഗക്ഷേമാദ്വൃണീതേ സോ ദി സേ ദർ ആർ ടു പാസ് ദി പാത്ത് ഓഫ് ശ്രേയസ് ദി സുപ്രീം ഗുഡ് ആൻഡ് ദി അതർ ഇസ് പ്രേയഹ ദി പ്ലസിൻറ്റ് ദീസ് ടു ഗീവ് ടു ഡിഫറെൻറ്റ് റിസൾട്ട്സ് സോ ദി ശ്രേയസ് വിൽ ഗീവ് യു ദി സുപ്രീം ഗുഡ് ഇറ്റ് വിൽ ഹെൽപ്പ് യു ടു റിയലൈസ് ദി സുപ്രീം റിയാലിറ്റി ആൻഡ് ദി സെക്കൻഡ് വൺ പ്രേയ വിൽ the you will not be you will not achieve that uh, ultimate purushartha parama purushartha you will fall down from that then he says this when the, it the both the paths are open to all human beings so among, among them among the human beings those who are dhiras those who are intelligent those who are apt for spiritual uh, progress spiritual achievement they opt for shreyas and the other opt for yoga kshema worldly pressures then he says satvam priyane priya rupam scha gaman abhidhyayan nachiketo atyasrakshi naitam shringam vittamayim avapto yasya yasyam majjanti bhagavo manushya so he nachiketa you are i have tempted you with so many uh, boons but you you have not accepted it you rejected all those things then he says duramete vipajite vishuchi avidyaya ca vidye tiknata vidya abhipsinam nachiketa sammanye tatva kama bhagavo alolupanta so the the shreya and praya marga or it is in, otherwise the synonyms are vidya and avidya shreya marga is opting for vidya opting for jnana prayo marga means opting for ajnana so i consider you i consider that you want to tread the path of vidya with uh, the path of uh, this knowledge jnana vidya abhipsinam natike natike sammanye you want to opt for this the marga of jnana marga whereas all the others the rest of the world is 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 Uh, they are interested in this prayo marga they are caught up in this mesh whereas you have a rare one who opted for the other one then avidyaya mantare vartamana swayam dhira panditam manyamana 
Gandramyamana Padyanti Mutha Ande Neva Niyamana Yatandraha. In this world there are people who guide. Many of them Avidyayam Antare Vartamana, those who are guide, guiding others. Many of them are immersed in ignorance. They guide these people in the spiritual path. So it is like a blind leading the blind. Then why all these things are being told? Because this choose the spiritual right, spiritual path is not easy actually. The mind you will be deluded, the mind will cheat you. Nobody else need cheat you. Your mind will cheat you. This is good, you will say. When a bad this is bad, somebody says, no, 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 this is good, you are a bad person. So our mind will delude us. So that is why it is keep on the, the choosing the right path. Once you choose the right path, the goal is achieved. Not much treading is there. Correct, you have to choose the right path and leave away the wrong one. What is to be thrown out, that you have to throw out. Other thing, there is nothing to choose. There is no walking in the spiritual path. You are already walking in the wrong direction. Stop that. That is, that is why it is told in different, different ways. Na sampadaya pradibadi bhalam pramatyantam vitta mohe namutam ayam loko nasti paridimani punapunaha Vasham apadyate me. You ask me whether anything exists after death, whether something exists after death or not. This Samparaya, Samparaya means the sadhana marga. Pradibadi bhalam. For a manda buddhi, for an ignorant man, the sadhana to be undertaken for achieving the highest good will not go enter into his head. He will not understand that. Why? Because Vitta Mohe Namutam. He has got a disease of these worldly pleasures. So he will not think about the highest good. So he will say, I am loko, nasti, I am loko, nasti pariti. This world is final. There is nothing beyond this. Why do you worry? They, they will say like that. Such people, again and again, they come to me. They come to me and go back and come to me and go back like that. So, there is, the Atma is there beyond this body and mind. And this Atma will be in that samsara chakra. It will be caught up in the samsara chakra because his mind is involved in this. Then he says, Shravanaya api bhaku bihi yo nalapyaha Shrinvanto api bhaku bo yamna vidyuhu Ascharyo bhakta kusala ostyalabdha, ascharyo jnata kusala nishishtaha. Now he says, so up, t- up till now, the qualification of the student has been told. The qualification of the student means total vairagya is required. Very rarely we come across with students, with seekers who have got full vairagya. So even if he has that vairagya, he should have a right teacher to guide him. Otherwise, ande neva niyamana hairartaha will come. So ascharyo bhakta, which is very rare to find a good teacher. Kushalo sialapta ascharyo jnata kushala nishishtaha. It is also equally rare to get a right type of shishya. So, and rare is, it is a wonder to get a teacher, good teacher. Equally, it is very rare to get a uh, genuine student. And instructed by that great master, this student realizes that is still a wonder. Then he says, Why I say this? Because, Why I say this? Because, Unless a realized person share this knowledge with you, it is not possible to realize. And realized people are rare. So, the knowledge has to be imparted by a person who really knows it actually. 
then only you will be, be able to understand. And he should also, the only when a realized person can pass on this knowledge. <coughs> then he says, Naishatarke namati rapaneya prokta anye neva sutnyanaya preshta yam tomapa satya dhirbadasi padrno buyan nachiketa preshta. Hey, nachiketa, you are a wonderful student. And you are established in truth. Hmm? So, this knowledge will not, you will not be able to acquire this knowledge just by reading, by analysis, by intellectual exercises. Uh, it is not possible to get it. And uh, this, and the, the, your mindset to reject everything for the sake of this. Yesha, Nesha Madhira. What is it? Nesha Tarkena Madhira Apaneya. This, this, the, the mindset, the, your conviction you, you, you had to reject everything, believing that there is something which is higher and I have to achieve it. That is not easy to acquire. Very rarely, people, students have that total vairagya. So you are very dear to me. I pray to God that I should get hereafter also students like you. So the good teachers, when they get a good student, they are very happy and they feel, Bhagawan, again and again you give me such type of students. Do you have any example like this? Do you remember? Amayantu Brahmacharyana Swaha Vimayantu Brahmacharyana Swaha Samayantu Brahmacharyana Swaha First it starts like this Avahanti Vitanvana Kurvana Chira Matmana Vasagum Sima Bhagavascha Annapane Chasarvada Tato Meshriyamavaha Lomasham Pashibhisraha Swaha but all this wealth I should have. Ama yandu brahmachari nalswaha. Let me have all the wealth to support these boys. And let that brahmachari come from all directions. So, this is told in a different way by Yama. So, you are very dear to me. I want students like you who ask this type of questions. This type of questions. Once Shankaracharya of Shingari Matha told a story only in one of his lectures. So, mi millions of people go and prostrate at his feet. Ashram also, people come to you. Swamiji is also. Swamiji, please bless us. Yeah. Swamiji, I have got this problem, please. Help me, please pray for me, they say. Okay. Whether anyone has got, asked you, Swamiji, kindly enlighten me the path of realization. Have any, anyone has asked you? Even to Gurudev Swami Shivanji Maharaj, how many people might have asked that? I have this problem, that problem, I have got this disease. Kindly enlighten me. How to? How to bless me so that I am free from this disease. I get more money, I get a job, I pass in the examination. You also go to Bhagawan and what you pray, what you have prayed and what you pray. Bhagawan, you give me money, why Bhagawan, you give me exam, pass in the examination, good job, good. All these worldly things only you ask. Have any time we ask Bhagavan, I want you to give me that realization. Whether anybody has asked him. Why? So, Acharya, one boy came and kindly enlightened me. He's, then he said, tears came on my eyes. Lacks of people come to me. No one asked me, has asked me like this. Because when you ask that, sincerity will also be known. Many times people will come and say, I am not able to properly meditate, kindly tell me how to meditate. That is an academic question. Kindly give me that enlightenment. How to approach Bhagavan, how to do that? This, this, this is an inquiry, this is an intellectual pursuit. Okay? Normally, when we take up the spiritual life, we want to know what is to be done. What exactly the sadhana we have to do, you ask it. How long you are asking? They will be asking for 10 years. One time, two time, 12 means it is okay. You leave everything. Pray to God. 
you leave everything they will reject pray to god is also not possible little prayer here and there they will do okay am i right this is the condition of everybody desire for god to the exclusion of all other things that is not possible so if one has that then you have to worship that fellow because he is already at the doorstep that is what emma says later then he says this so what your mindset your determination to reject everything and to opt for this is something very unique and i would like to have shishyas like you then he says even in my case janamyaham shevathiranityam nashyadruvehi prapyadehi druvam tat tato maya nachiketaschitognihi anityer dravye praptavanasminityam i know all these things fully well but in spite of that i know that all these wealth is perishable still i did the nachi agni chayana and and achieved this position even my case is like that is this and this this position which is relatively permanent only i achieved i did not achieve that he says then whereas in your case kamasyaptim jagatapratishtam kritoranandyam abhayasya param it is anantyam ar anantyam kritoho what is the mantra kritoho anantya eh? kritor anantyam is there it is eh? which you are referring in this it is anantya what is you are you are referring different book uh-huh. kritor anantya i think actually hmm? kritor anantya is durga is there in this it should be hrasva kritor anantyam abhayasya param because what i read early that comes in my mind stomam mahadurigayam pratishtam drishtva dritya dhiro natikeetu atyasrakshisi again he says i have tempted you up to the level of hiranyagarbha kamasya optimis you can kam kamanam kamabhajam karomi so i will make you those in such a i will place you in such a position so that all your desires will be fulfilled in one stroke that also you have rejected all the animals all the mind, the siddhis everything i promised you have rejected hmm? so such a wonderful person he keep on repeating it actually shast the upanishad is repeating the glory of the nachiketa again and again thereby upanishad is glorifying the vairagya it is a vairagya prakarana what is our problem our problem is our mind is interested in this world and the mouth says i want god okay you are hypocrites mind wants something tongue says something what is there in the mind or what is there in the tongue are not true i want bhagwan i want bhagwan mind whether bhagwan is laughing do you really want me so that is why it is keep on telling this is so kramena kalakramena this vairagya has to come the successes are required day will come mind will automatically reject all these things nothing will disturb you now you are disturbed not that you should not have all these things you can all have this but mind should not be there like janaka if that goes if it is not there it should not disturb so tam durdarsham gudam anupravishtam guhahitam gakhvareshtam puranam adhyatma yoga adigamena devam matva dhiro harsha shoga ujagati so having realized that supreme reality which is very difficult to achieve and which remains in the heart chamber that you have to achieve through the adhyatma yoga by the sadhana and having realized that one goes beyond harsha and shoka beyond the pleasure and pain beyond sukha and sukha and dukkha the pairs of opposites will not be there this world is painful because the world is full of pairs of opposites the world is full of pairs of opposites there is no permanent sukha here there is also no permanent dukkha sukha and dukkha sukha and dukkha keep on coming like that and 
So at one, up to one level it is Sukha and at another level it is Dukkha. So our, our problem is, our problem is pairs of opposites. And Bhagavan is beyond pairs of opposites. Rudri is that only. Namapur bhajaya cha parajaya cha namo madhyamaya cha bhagalpaya cha namo shreshtaya cha kanishtaya cha namo jeshtaya cha kanishtaya cha namapur bhajaya cha parajaya cha so all the pairs of opposites all the pairs of opposites are harsha shau go jagati you go beyond harsha shoka and, and uh, pain and pleasure in sleep what happens Neither there is pain is there, nor pleasure is there. That ānanda is not sukha. Okay? What you enjoy during the sleep, that is not the sukha when you eat the kheer huh? or vada. Huh? That is different actually. So, he goes beyond that, he says. Heta chrutva sampadi grihya matya ha pravishya dharmam anumap Anumetam apya sa modade modaniyam hilaptva rivrdham satna nachiketa sam manye And having heard this, having heard about that Atma and having understood and having realized it. Anumetam apya sa modade modaniyam hilaptva And having achieved that, he is in a state of total bliss. He nachiketa. I consider you are at the doorstep of that. Upadesha is not there. Nachiketasam labdva vivardagam sadma nachiketasam The door is open and you are standing there. You need not knock that. Already it is open. It is open already. So you have to only walk in. Then he asks all these explanations. What is that you are speaking? I don't understand. We say uh, uh, Harsha Shoka Jakati, you will go beyond Harsha and Shoka. You will go beyond Dharma and Dukkha and uh, Sukha. What is that? That is what, that is what he asked. Anyatra Dharmat, Anyatra Adharmat, Anyatra Asmat Kritat Agrat, Anyatra Bhutacha Bhavyacha, Yatat Pashyaji Tadvada. What is that you see beyond the pairs of opposites? Dharma and Adharma is the pairs of opposites. What is that you see beyond these two? Dharma Danyat, Adharma Danyat, Krita Danyat, Akrita Danyat. That is beyond the cause and the effect, Kairi and Karana. And what is beyond the past and the future? What is that is Kalyadita? What you behold, what you see, please explain that to me. What is that Bhagavan? That is actually the question is. Who is that Bhagavan? So, we say it is Rama. Rama means what? Anandam. Ananda. Okay. Rama means? Yogino itra ramanti iti. Rama. Rama means? Not in this ordinary happiness. The supreme bliss. Krishna is also the same thing. Then he says, Sarve Veda yatpa damamanandi tapamsi sarvani ca yatpa danti Yadi chando brahma jadyam charanti Tate padam sangrahena pravimi omityatadu That supreme thing which is beyond the dharma and the dharma, which is beyond all, which is transcends the pairs of opposites. In this world, everything is full of pairs only. In this world, everything is pairs of opposites only. That which is beyond the world is transcends the pairs of opposite. Tall, short, happy and happy, everything, cold, heat, darkness, light. What is a photo? Light and shade. I am able to see you because there is light and shade is there. If total light is there, I will not be able to see you. So he says, that is, people, for what? To realize that, Sarve Veda Yat Pada Mamananda, that Pada, that Supreme Reality, which the Vedas glorify, what the tapas, take, all the tapas takes you to where? 
Hedichendo Brahmacharyam Charanti. Desiring to achieve what? People are observing the Brahmacharya Dharma. That pada I tell you in short. Om Ityatat. That pada, that supreme reality, that Bhagavan is called Om. Om is Brahma. The, the Tasya Vachakaha Pranavaha. Pranava is the its name. You have got a name. Like that the name of Bhagavan is Om. Then he said, Yadad Devaksharam Brahma. Yadad Devaksharam. This we have to take now, I think. Okay? This is where we have to start. Yadad Devaksharam. Yadad Hi Eva. Yadad Yadad Hi Eva. Yadad Devaksharam Brahma. Yadad Devaksharam Param. Yadad Devaksharam Yatva. Yo Yadichati. Tasya Tat. This Achara. This Om. This Om. Yadadhyavaksharam Brahma. This Acharam is Brahman. Yadadhyavaksharam Param. It is also Parabrahman. It is also Aparabrahman. It is also Parabrahman. Parabrahman means the supreme reality which is beyond all the gunas, Nirguna. Aparabrahman means Saguna. We call it as Bhagavan. Bhagavan, we say it is Saguna. The very same Bhagavan, when you put it in Saguna and Nirguna, is not in Bhagavan. When we call it Saguna, Bhagavan, it becomes uh, Saguna, that's all. Bhagavan is not Saguna, Bhagavan is not Nirguna. He is both Saguna and Nirguna. Okay, you, when I say that, that it is beyond the pairs of opposite, don't bring this pairs of opposite, Saguna and Nirguna. <laughs> that is also pairs of opposite, you see. That is also reconciled. He is Saguna, he is Nirguna also. This Om is Saguna and Nirguna. Om is Para and Apara. It is Om is the Parabrahman. Om is the Aparabrahman. How you take it? How you want it accordingly? Oh. You can call the Parabrahma as Krishna. If you want it Krishna, you can call him Krishna and have him. If you want, don't want to call him, I want to call him Parabrahman, you can. The very same person is Parabrahman. The very same Brahman person is Aparabrahman also. Parabrahman and Aparabrahman too is not there. Even Vankara is also, Vankara is Param and Vankara is Aparam. Yetad Dhyeva Aksharam Brahma. Yetad Dhyeva Aksharam Param. And Param is Param Brahma. Okay? Yetad Dhyeva Aksharam Yatva. Having realized this, Yo Yedichasi, Yedichati Tasyatate. What you want, then you will get it. Ye Yatha Maam Prabhadyante, Tam Stadeva Bhajamyam. If you want to approach him, I want to, my Bhagavan to be very sweet Bhagavan. Then all right, we, we will become sweet to you. I don't want to, I want to enter into you. All right, you enter into me. Bhagavan has no choice. Whatever you want to do, you choose. According to you, he will be. I want to enter into you, okay, you enter into me. I want to sit at your feet, you sit at my feet. I want to sit at your head, all right, you sit at my head also. He has no botheration. So, yo yadichati. Tasya tate. So according to your upasana, how do you do upasana? How do you think about him? Accordingly he appears before you. Now what is your upasana? Our upasana is our kamya vastu. You understand me? Our upasana is our kamya vastu, is our Bhagavan. Okay? You are doing upasana of something means Anna upasana means Anna is your Brahman. Anna Brahme Divya Janat. I want good food. Very strong desire is there. That means you are doing upasana of Anna. Annam Brahme, Divya Janath. Okay. Bhagavan is, you know, don't, mind is entertaining Bhagavan only. How do you entertain accordingly? He is there. If you stand before an opaque mirror, you will have a flooded image. Very clean mirror means very clean image. So it has not, so it is, it, it, your position is not, the image is because according to the choice, choice of the mirror. Likewise, your mind projects, whether if you want to project is Brahman, Parabrahman, it is Parabrahman. If it projects as Aparabrahman, it is Aparabrahman. Okay? There is no two Parabrahman and Aparabrahman, two is not there. The one truth is called by different names. What is that sloka? Tat Badanti, Brahmedi, Paramatmedi. Eh? What is that sloka? You know it. <laughs> <laughs> he knows. Brahmetni Paramatmeji Bhagavan Shabjati. Vadanti Tat Tattavidat Tattum Yajnana Vatbhayam. 
ब्रह्मेदि परमात्मेदि भगवान इति शब्देते वदन्ति तत् तत्त्वविदः तत्त्वविदः तत्त्वं वदन्ति कम हौ दे से ब्रह्मेदि परम ब्रह्मेदि परमात्मेदि भगवान इति शब्देते ब्रह्म परमात्मा भगवान परब्रह्मन अपरब्रह्मन ऑल लिस्ट सुब्रह्मण्य भगवती रामा कृष्ण पंडरीनाथ सब्दी ओके ऑल आर अवर ओल मैंड कन्सेप्ट सो एकक्षर ब्रह्म एकक्षर परम एकक्षर ज्ञावा यो यदिच्छसी इच्छति तस्य तत् आज यू इच्छा आज युवर इच्छा आज युवर पास युवर इच्छा मीन्स वाट इज युवर इच्छा Your ichcha is your upasana. Okay? Your ichcha is your upasana. Bhagavan's upasana, if you want to do means, there should be a strong desire for Bhagavan here. Otherwise, you are, you, it is not Bhagavan's upasana. You go on to a, some, somebody and wants to have some help from him. You are not doing upasana. You are trying to cheat him. Okay? Um, I want to get something from you. Um, I say something to you and get it actually. So what I want, I, I don't want you. I want the thing from you. Likewise, what is our what our mind is desiring? That uh, that is the our object of upasana. Okay, this you should understand. If you don't understand this, then you will be thinking we are doing ishara upasana. Ishara upasana means. You are desire to have Ishara. Okay, okay. Bhagwan's love for Bhagwan should be. I want you should be there. Mind should long for him. If mind longs for something else and do pass enough, that you are buttering him. You are buttering Bhagwan Sri Krishna to get this. So that is not pass enough. You should butter Bhagwan to get him. Why are you applying? I want to get you. Then it is upasana. That is upasana. That is why what he is telling us here: Yo ye dischati tasya tatu. What you desire, accordingly it appears. The God appears to us in the form. That is why Lakshmi Kubera Kubera Puja. What is that? What is that? Upasana Murti is what Lakshmi. Then not Krishna. Okay. Yada dalam banam srestam. Yada dalam banam param. एतद आलंबन ज्ञात्व ब्रह्मलोक ब्रह्मलोके महीयते दिस इज अ ग्रेट आलंबन आलंबन मी सपोर्ट एतद आलंबन दिस एतद मीन्स व्हाट ओम दिस ओम दिस ओम इज द ग्रेट आलंबन दैट इज व्हाई आवर मंत्र इज फॉर ऑल द सन्यासिन्स व्हाट इज द मंत्र ओम ऑल अदर मंत्रस यू कैन यूज बट आवर मंत्र इज ओम दिस इज एतद आलंबन श्रेष्ठम आलंबन इट इज परब्रह्म And apana brahma also. Yet that is alambanam shrestam. Yet that is alambanam paradisam. Param alambanam, highest alamba, highest support, and the best support. Yet that alambanam nyatwa having understood this, brahma leoke mahiyate. You are, you will be enjoying the brahma leoka. Brahma leoke mahiyate. You can go up to Hiranyagarbha. Other, if you take it in the upasana is on param brahma, you become one with him. Krama Mukti and Sadhya Mukti both are told here. You, you have got the meaning. Yet the Alam Banam. Yet this is the best Alam Banam. Alam Banam is support. You take a prop for a creeper. A prop is there. Support is there. Yet the Alam Banam Shrestam. Yet the Alam Banam Param. Yet the Alam Banam Yatwa. Having known this, Brahma Loka is Mohi. Yet you enter into the Brahma Loka. Then, not, then next is Loka. This is in the Gita. It comes. Nayya Te Amriya Deva. विपच्चि ना कुदचिन्न बभूव कचि अजो निशुतोम पुराणो न हन्यते हन्यम शरीर दिस् ब्रह्म दिस् परब्रह्म आर अपर ब्रह्म न ज्ञाते न जायते न जायते न म्रियते वा दिस् आत्मा इट ईज नईदर इज बॉर्ड नॉर इट ईज डेट विपच्चि विपच्चि ना कुतचि दिस् विपच्चि विपच्चि मीन ज्ञानस्वूप ज्ञानस्वूपात्मा वट इज बीज विपश्चि विपश्चि मेधावी ओके मेधावी
What is it? Okay, okay, okay. There it is. Vibhaschin Medhavi. A vipari lupta. Chaitanya Swabhavat. It is a pure Chaitanya Swabhava. Pure Chaitanya Swabhava. Which is Atma. That is Jnana Swarupa Atma. Jnana Swarupa Atma. That Paramatma is never born, nor it dies. That it is it is not the it is not the cause. The Kudashin Nabhabu Vakashit. It is neither born nor it gives birth. It is neither the cause nor it is the effect. Okay. Now Jayade and Mariade means it is neither born nor it dies. And also it is not the cause of anything, it is also not the effect of anything. Bhagavan has created this world. That means Bhagavan is doing some creation activities like that. The world has come from Bhagavan, means Bhagavan is the cause and this world is the effect. It is not that way actually. So like that, this is neither the cause nor the effect. It is neither born nor it dies, it is neither the cause nor it is the effect. Ajaha, it is unborn, nityaha, everlasting. Shashwadaha, Shashwadaha means what? Sukshma, apachayarahitaha, vridhichayarahitaha. Shashuddha does not mean eternal. Shashuddha here because it is Nitya, it is a Nitya and Shashuddha means it is Chaya Rahitaha, Jara Ityadina, Puranaha, eternal. The Hanya De Hanya Mane Shedi De. So in the Gita, what is the sloka? Najaya De Mriya De Vagata Ajit, Bhavita Vana Bhuyaha, Ajo Nitya Shashuddha Yam Purano, the Hanya De Hanya Mane Shedi De. This sloka only taken the same meaning actually. So this Paramatma, this Atma, Atma Chaitanya, which you are searching, which you asked for, which is the Bhagavan, is na, na, na jayate, na mriyate, na, it is not a cause nor effect, it is eternal and uh, ajaha, unborn, eternal and vridhichay uh, rahitaha and na hanyate hanyamane shariyari even a person dies, the Atma won't die. Hanyamani said, even some, some in the body is damaged, the body is, dies, he will not die actually. No, Hanyate, Hanyamani said, when the body dies, he will not die, the Atma will not die. Why this is told? Because, Asti di jayke, Nari Masti di jayke, he asked. When, when you, when the body dies, when, you, when, it, when the body dies and goes away, then whether, what, whether the Atma is there or not, he says. So whether the body is there or it dies, it has nothing to do with this Atma has, is not affected by any way because it is not born when the body is born. It never dies when body is dies. Okay? The Atma is not born when the body is born. Why? Eh? The Atma is not born when the body is born. Your Atma is not born when your body is born. Why? Your body eh? Why? Your Atma is not when your body is born. Why? Because it is all-pervading. The body is born in the Atma. Okay? <laughs> See, when these walls are dismantled, the space is not affected. Okay? That is the reason. When the, this wall is, this room is there, the room was constructed. Before construction, this room was not there. After destruction, this room was not there. But the space, which we call it as the room, that is neither was neither destroyed nor it is born. The room, the space was not born when the walls were constructed. When the walls are broken, the space is not lost. So the Atma is all-pervading. Your Atma and my Atma are not there. Mr. Chalan Swamiji's Atma and Shubhaktan Swamiji's Atma, two Atmas are not there, there is only one Atma. If you consider my Atma, then it, there is no such thing as my Atma. Paramatma is only one. That Paramatma, inside the Paramatma, only you are there. Okay? In spite of studying all the Upanishads, this doubt is there. There is no such thing as... A, atma cannot be finite thing. It is an infinite one. Atma is... Bhagavan means what? He is all-pervading. You are inside Bhagavan. 
Why do you search for him? You are inside him. He is inside you, he is outside you. This body existence is because of the mind actually. The mind has created this body within the Tatma. Okay? Why you nobody is telling anything? Neither you are accepting nor you are rejecting it actually. Your Atma is not something special to you. Your Atma and his Atma and then the dog's Atma and monkey's Atma, our Shatru's Atma, our friend's Atma are one only. Body is only different. Body eh? no, body. So that is why the Jayate, Jayate means what? It is not born. The Jayate. Namriyate. The Atma is not born and the Jayate, Namriyate, then Namriyate Vipaschite, the Kutaschit, Babu Vakaschit, Ajo, Nityaha, Shashwataha, Puranaha. So it is eternally remaining there. And it is apakshe rahitaha, nityaha. It is permanently there. The body comes and goes. Comes and goes in the Atma. Yomam pashyati sarvatra sarvam chamay pashyati Bhagavan's Vishwarupa and all these things. What we understand by this? Bhagavan's Vishwarupa is whatever we see here is Bhagavan's Vishwarupa. You are, you, you are, you, everything here is Bhagavan's Vishwarupa. Okay? Then, anorani yan mahato mahi yan. Atmasya jantor nihito guhayam tamakradhu pasya divita shoko dhadu prasadhan mahimana matmanaha. Eh? Eh? Oh, Hanta jen manya de hantum, Hatas jen manya de hantum, Uboto navijani to, Nayam hantina 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 is also in the Gita, you know the meaning. Hanta jen, if anyone thinks I slay, I will slay him. I am slain. I, I will slay him. I am slain. I am killed. I will kill him. Both of them do not know because you cannot kill the Atma. It can never be killed. It can never be a killer. It can never be a killer, nor it can be killed. Because it is eternal. It is neither born, nor uh, it, it dies, nor undergoes any change. So the body is killed. The body undergoes change, the mind undergoes change. It is eternal. You cannot kill the air. You cannot even kill the earth. You cannot kill even a stone. It will be powdered, it will remain in another form only. Okay? Nothing we can do here. So, this Atma is not killed, nor it is, neither is a killer nor it is killed. Whosoever thinks it can be done like that, that is not correct. Both of Nivijan, though they do not know. One who considers I am killed, I am slain, I, I will slay. He doesn't know. The same sloka is there in the Gita. What is that? Same thing is there, I think. Mm-hmm. Then next sloka. Anorani yan mahato magi yan atmas jantor nikitam gukayam tamakratuhu pasya jivita shoko dhadu prasadat mahimanam atmanaham. See, this Atma is anorani yan mahato mahiyan. It is subtler than the subtlest and greater than the great. Atma se janto nihidam guhaya. It is there in your hridayakasha. Who will see that? Tam akratuhu pasyati. Akratuhu means asha rehitaha. One who has no desire. So, one whose mind is devoid of desires, he sees this Paramatma. As long as the desire is there, you will see only the desire. When the mind is free of desires, then you see that. Akratu kvartaha. Akamaha. Akamaha. Kratu kamaha. Kratu means actually yaga yajna kratu ishti. Kratu means that the yaga karma. Why you do the karma? Why you do the yajna? For achieving something. So the desire. Akratu means that kama rehitaha. Asha rehitaha. Akamaha. Pashyati. Vita shoka ha. So without any shoka he here he is he will see that Paramatma. How Dhadu Prasadat. Dhaduhu is there. Visarga should not be there. Dhadu Prasadat. Dhaduhu Prasadat is Vaishnava Vakyana. Eh? Dhaduhu Visarga is there? Ah. Dhadu Prasadati Mahimana Vatmanaha. 
ధాతు ప్రసాద్ ఆర్ట్ మీన్స్ ధాతు మీన్స్ ఆల్ దీస్ మైండ్ ఇంద్రియాస్ ఎక్సెట్రా ఆర్ ధాతు సో వాట్ ఈస్ క్రియేటింగ్ ప్రాబ్లమ్ ఫర్ అస్ ఓన్లీ ది ఇంద్రియాస్ అండ్ ది మైండ్ ఓకే ఆల్ అవర్ ప్రాబ్లమ్స్ ఆర్ ఆర్ క్రియేషన్ ఆఫ్ అవర్ మైండ్ అండ్ ఇంద్రియాస్ ఇఫ్ యు ఆర్ ఎ స్మాల్ బేబీ యు బ్లడీ ఫుడ్ ఐ సే వాట్ విల్ హ్యాపన్ నవ్ యూ స్మైల్ బికాస్ మైండ్ ఈస్ నాట్ అక్సెప్టింగ్ దట్ నవ్ ఇఫ్ ఐ సే యు ఆర్ అ బ్లడీ ఫుడ్ బికాస్ యూ బికమ్ యాంగ్రీ సో వెన్ ది మైండ్ అండ్ ది సెన్స్ ఆర్గన్స్ వెన్ దే కోఆపరేట్ వెన్ దే డోంట్ వాంట్ ఎనీథింగ్ ఫ్రమ్ హియర్ దెన్ దాతు ప్రసాద ఈజ్ దేర్ మీన్స్ మన ప్రసాద మన ప్రసాద సూమ్యత్వం అంటే ఇది గీత శ్లోక మౌన ఆత్మ వినిగ్రహ భావ సంశుద్ధి ఇత్యేత తపో మానసం ఉచ్చతి ఓకే కరెక్ట్ కరెక్ట్ సో ధాతు ప్రసాద్ ఆది మీన్స్ మన ప్రసాద ఇఫ్ ది ఇంద్రియాస్ అండ్ ది మైండ్ ఆర్ ఫేవరబుల్ ఇఫ్ దే డోంట్ వాంట్ ఎనీథింగ్ హియర్ ధాతు ప్రసాద్ ఆది దిస్ విషన్ యు గెట్ దట్ విషన్ పశ్యతి అక్రదు పశ్యతి హౌ వీత శోక శోకం శోకరహిత హాసన్ తమ్ ఆత్మానం పశ్యతి ఆనందస్వరూపం ఆత్మానం పశ్యతి ఆనందస్వరూపో భవతి ఇత్యర్థ ultimately what is told here all our problems are our own creation your samsara is a creation so one day or other we should purge all these things from our mind mind should be free from all entanglements here everything is fine here beautiful here papa ramdas and others you know, how they lived gurudev so when the mind is free of all these things unwanted projection and wanted desires that that is why all the sadhana is to remove those desires one by one one by one one by one like that so the adu prasadat mahimana atman atma the mahima the greatness of that atman will be seen when the mind and the indriyas cooperate they don't pull you in a different direction okay now we want to go there but the mind pulls you here so when the mind is no more pulling there it is seen. okay సహనావతు సహనో భునక్తు సహ వీర్యం కరవాహై తేజస్వినవధీతమస్తు మా విద్విషావహై ఓం శాంతి శాంతి హరి ఓం